Welcome to this week's JVA Coach to Coach video, video of the, of week. the week. week. Brought to you by Ultra Ankle, the official ankle brace of the JVA. Hi, I'm Tim Keating, club director and lead trainer for Adrenaline Volleyball Academy in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. Today we are going to go through two defensive drills that we find helps our players with eye sequence and first step quickness with relentless pursuit of the ball on defense while incorporating conditioning that is volleyball specific. The first drill requires two players and a ball. One player will begin the drill approximately 10 feet away from the other player, setting the ball to themselves. The second player will be in a defensive posture with their eyes focused on the hands of the setter. The player setting the ball has three options to initiate the ball. Option one is a simulated setter attack in which the player defending must execute a disciplined base position to defend the attack. Option two and three is to set the ball to a height allowing the defensive player to release from base positioning and transition their vision to the arm of the attacker. Player one can choose to show a tip by extending their arm in which player two must release forward to defend or position their body to attack the ball forcing the defender to balance prior to contact and dig the ball back to the partner. In all phases of this drill, the defender must cover after they have defended the ball. In the first phase of the drill, you will see the players nearest the camera are focused on one player as the defender the entire time. We will typically time this phase around 45 seconds to one minute, depending on the level of the player. In the second phase of this drill, being executed by the next two players, we implement an exchange of responsibilities each time a ball is defended and covered. The emphasis of this phase is to keep the ball in play throughout the entire drill. We typically time this phase one and a half to two minutes with 30 second breaks between rounds. The second defensive drill involves a group of three athletes and a ball. The drill is set up with one player laying flat on their stomach facing the net, one player at the net with a ball, and the third player at the net next to the player with a ball. This is a run-through drill that requires explosive footwork to pursue a replicated short tip. When the player that is laying on their stomach reaches their feet, the player at the net will toss a ball approximately the height of the antenna and a distance away from the net that would land on the 10-foot line. The player is to run through the ball making contact and understanding the platform movement using a J-stroke motion to keep the ball on their side of the net. Once the player reaches the feet on the end line, the third player will sprint to the end line and get down onto their stomach. They will be the next one to go. The player that executed the run through will now initiate the next ball. We typically run this drill for 45 to 60 second segments with 30 seconds between rounds. We will do this for four or five rounds. Thank you for taking the time to watch these defensive drills that we like to execute at many of our training sessions. I hope you found them useful to implement into your gym environment. Best of luck to you and your teams this season. Thank you for watching the JVA Coach to Coach video, video of, of the week. week.